What up is Cam and welcome to Grey Hill Instant. This is a alien horror game. Uh They just don't make enough games of this. Like I was so excited to see that this was released in the store because I missed the beta version that came out on PC. I think it was on Xbox. And this just came out, so I'm very happy to get to play this. They just never make a, uh, an alien horror game. I think the last time I played an alien game was probably like on the 360 Destroy All Humans. Classic game, honestly amazing. So I'm really excited to play this because all I've heard about it is it's good. Like the the reviews say it's a very good uh alien game. And it started off with like a small little game and now it's just huge. So yeah, uh, without further ado, let's get on with the video. I'm actually really excited to play this. Cornfields. <clears throat> Why is it that Please, can you oh. hear me? Someone was in our backyard next to her dog last night. When my husband came out with his gun, the unknown was gone. Since then, our dog has disappeared. I want to file a complaint. I'll call the police in a few minutes. Amy, as you already know, I don't trust these people. Neither the government nor anyone else, and you shouldn't trust them either. We founded our neighborhood watch for such cases. I don't want to see a policeman in Grey Hill. Brandon, I want this to stop. The whole thing has been going on for several weeks. I'm really afraid. After all, several animals have already disappeared, and Grandma Mary is... Oh, we should have already reported it to the police long ago. I know that's a hard case, Amy. The Neighborhood Watch takes care of it. It's Ryan's turn today. He will visit you tonight during his tour. He isn't an elite soldier, and he wasn't in the Vietnam War either. <laughs> but you know he played baseball as a professional. He can handle the bat. In addition, you can sleep better at night if you remember that a neighbor is patrolling outside, even if he can't hold on to his wife. Leave him in peace. Ouch. It's hard enough for him to deal with his situation. Let me finish. Don't tell the policeman anything. Otherwise, we all end up in the psychiatric ward. Are you trying to tell them we think there are little green men running around? Gray, Brandon. They are gray. <laughs> but Amy, trust me, you don't want to end up in the psychiatric ward. Since that special incident in my childhood, I've spent my entire youth in a psychiatric ward. I've paid a high price to break free. The uh, only way to escape I was- I can't hear that anymore. You've told your stupid story a thousand times. In Vietnam, we went through something like this basically every day. What does Vietnam have to do with it? However, for two weeks, I wear my tinfoil hat when I'm going out of the caravan. I believe they can control us through their telepathic abilities. I'm con Convinced that the hat protects me. Brandon is right. They won't help us. They would rather make our lives hell. But I would still prefer if an officer stopped by here. You know, I almost drank petrol last week. I forgot I put it in a Coke bottle. Bob, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Amy, I forbid you to call the police. Ryan, you can hear me, right? My daughter didn't talk the whole day. When she was in the forest with your son in the morning, there was a strange noise, and Henry was curious about it. He went closer to it. Rachel ran home, but Henry stayed there. Henry went home later, right? What has he seen there? Rude kid. Instead of saving my daughter, he left her alone, and she had to run home by herself. Brandon, that's enough. It's been two months since his mother left me. Henry still isn't talking to me. He just so can't get over I assume I'm Ryan, business. then? I'm glad he has your daughter to hang out with. Rachel's a good kid. I was sleeping the past few hours because of my shift tonight. I think Henry came home a few minutes ago. I heard him lock himself in his room. But he's probably just watching TV like always. Anything to avoid talking to his old man. I think he'll come out soon. What? Uh, they went to your house together, Ryan. Henry wasn't alone. Definitely not alone. No, Rachel has been home for several hours. You're crazy, Bob. Oh. Ryan, you really need to talk to Henry. I know what I've seen. I'm not crazy, Brandon. However, it was very dark. Ryan, just take a look at Henry now. Guys, you need to board up your windows and doors. So... Now, if you haven't done it yet, he brought back That's a, great idea, Bob. a gray I'll reach out man to, the other to my house. Telling them board up all the stuff just until this shit is over and everything is all right again the fact is the government is hiding something from the people 
things like this didn't just happen here in Greyhill. It started with Roswell, but it's been increasing since the 60s. That's the way it is. Oh, Ryan, my kitty cat. Please look for her during your shift. I'm really lonely without her. Uh, sure. Rachel and Henry are more important right now. But if I could find your cats, I'll let you know. Okay, Bob? I'll try to talk to my kid now, but that's if he'll talk to me. Call me if there's something new. Don't forget to visit us later, Ryan. We'll make some coffee for you. Yeah, sure. Thanks, Amy. Oh, I'm actually playing. Okay. Well, that was a long introduction. Holy shit. Uh, I was going to say at the start of the video is um, why is it right in Alien games? It's always cornfields. In every single film that has got aliens in it, it starts with cornfields. Why? It's like the the trademark for like an alien film is oh okay that's my flashlight. It's like cornfields. It's like why? Why not? God damn it! He still hasn't fixed the TV. Hello, Henry. Tell me what you saw in the forest today. You should ask Rachel, that crazy girl. Henry, there's someone in your room. Is Rachel in there? Oh, God. She should stop bothering me. What the fuck is, What's in, going the on fuck is you, in the room? Tell me. Also, you're not really watching Who's TV. There? That's, I'm going that's to your room, static. Henry. Stay here. Yeah. Great channel. Great channel. Oh. This computer is, um... Some wood I'm looking for. Oh, yeah. Fuck. Okay, which one's your room, Henry? This one? I think so. Oh, God, it's got some trophies. Someone was in your room. They went out the window. No. What's that? Max is barking! No shit! <sighs> Fuck this hell. Max, what is it? Yeah, you stay there. Mm -hmm. You stay there and watch static. Fucking child. Smart. Someone in the shed? Who's there? Oh, there's someone in the shed. Is someone in the shed? Be quiet. I need to find something to break this door. Um. I need to find something to break this door. Oh, stop ruining my shed, bitch. Uh Oh this will do nicely. Crowbar. Lovely. Just down there. Who's in here? Rachel? Oh. You left a bloody mess. Thanks for leaving a mess. Oh, that noise. No, Max! They locked me in my own garage. They actually locked me in my own garage. Oh, there we go. Oh, God. Max! Stay here! Uh, Max, I wouldn't. Max! Max! And Max! Dog is Max. dead. Cool. My dog is dead. My dog is gonna get probed in the bum. Sounds like the neighbors are boarding up their windows. I guess I should do the same. Are we just not gonna go after Max? Same. Like, are we just not gonna like Man. hop over the fence and go and get him? This is over soon. No. What the hell was that light? I'm just gonna pretend that Max just did not just running after a light and possibly get probed. Dad, it wasn't Rachel, right? Yeah, he uh, locked the door and ran out of the roof. It's okay, he's gone now. But there was a strange light. Look, the TV. It's working now. Oh, that's how it works. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. 
Lunatics and conspiracy theorists Lunatics. claim to have seen a UFO. <laughs> Lunatics. The minority tries to convince other people that the small green aliens are real. The government has checked into this incident and has announced that this UFO, fortunately, is just a weather balloon. That's no this weather balloon. That's no just weather balloon. I just had, I just had one of them in my back there is yard. No reason to concern in, all, in my garage. It fucking locked me in it. That is not a weather balloon. They're no. lying. The government is lying and they're trying to hide it from us. Brandon was right. They're already in Grey Hill. We can't talk about it to the police. They'll just lock us up in a psych ward. Dad, we need to get out of this cursed place. I hate this neighborhood hole. I hate you. I'll go talk to Brandon. Is it me or does he look like such a little shit? Look at him. Staked on him, Elvis looking ass bitch. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. <laughs> hello, hello. I'm here. Ryan, something is wrong with Joe Parson, the farmer, you know. He called me a few minutes ago. He was very afraid. Then the radio connection became broken off by something. He is working on the field near your house. You must check immediately what happened to him. Okay, I'll go check on him. By the way, someone was in Henry's room. They escaped out the window. I almost caught them in our shed. But there was a strange blue light. I'm sure they're here. Pull yourself together. Have you seen the TV news? No one will help us. We're all boarding up our windows currently. I know how to shoot because of the Vietnam War, and you can handle the baseball bat. We will overcome this night and drive to our holiday home by tomorrow. Don't forget how I shot your son's hat off while wearing it when I was drunk at the barbecue last summer. Excuse me? Imagine how I can handle the gun when I'm sober. Uh, you, you shot my son. Uh, Brandon! You still have to pay for that. Oh. But leaving town tomorrow sounds like a good idea. I'll keep you updated. Over and out. That's not a cow. Fuck is that noise? Oh. Hello cows. Moo to you too, sir. Moo to you too. Oh. Are they dead? Oh, they are. Oh, they're all dead. Oh, they've all been skinned. All right? Ooh. Nice. I don't think so. Damn it. Oh. What's in? Ah. Brandon. Brandon, this is Joe. They're trying to break into my tractor. This message gets to you. Walkie talkie connection broke. They're small and gray. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh, no. So, Joe has been probed. I assume. Shoved a metal thing right up his ass. Rest in peace, Joe. What is that? Oh, it's the kitty cat! Oh, fuck. What'd they do to you? What the? Is this Bob's cat? The hell did they do to this cat? What the hell is on her head? I mean, it looks like Kitty. I should bring her to his caravan. Uh, yeah, where is his caravan anyway? Oh, I see a caravan. I assume it's Bobby Oats. Bob is not going to be pleased about this cat. I don't know what the fuck these are on him. He's an alien cat. Alien space cat. He already boarded up his door weeks ago. 
I'll have to try the dormer window on his roof. Okay. Hello? Bobby? I go to Catty Cat. Hello? Hello? Ooh. Someone was cooking. Oh, it's, com it's cozy in here, isn't it? Oh, I like this. Oh, there they are. The little green men. Oh, fuck! Ryan! Yeah. I thought that was you on my roof. <gasps> Is this Kitty? My cat? Um, yes. Yeah, I caught her out in the field near the tractor. Oh, what does she have on her head? Um, I don't know. It makes don't know if you still noise. want your cat, sir, because it sounds it's... like electricity or something. Oh, and Bob, I had a strange encounter in my backyard. There was also some kind of weird electricity. I'll tell you about it later. Let's look at the cat first. Uh, put her on the table. I'll take a closer look. Okay. Well, that cat is proper fucked, isn't it? Mm. It looks oh, like a nice image. hat, dude. Some kind of probe. Can I have one? Ryan, I think they abducted Kitty and had experiments. By the way, have you boarded up your house? No. It's really dangerous in Greyhill these days. No, not yet. You should do it immediately. You need to wear a tinfoil hat. Your son Henry too. They go into your brains by telepathy. Also, don't forget, don't ever tell anything to the police. As Brandon said before, the government knows it. Now, take this preparation for your walkie-talkie. The tinfoil's on the oh. kitchen desk. Do it! Ah, oh, brilliant. Oh, I can make myself my own hat. Oh, oh it's my walkie talkie. Oh. Ryan, please check the monitors. Fast! Huh? What the hell is this? Ryan, no, 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 something very bad. Oh, are they coming? Oh, no. down the door with your baseball bat and take care. Wait, you want me to break down your own door? If you say so, dude. I'm not paying for that. Okay, wait. Before I go, hang on, we gotta do it. Henry, can you hear me? <laughs> That's amazing. Henry? Why are you picking up, you bastard? Maybe I should turn around. Okay, don't go that way. Do I go this way? So now there's grey men walking around. So now I don't feel safe. What's this? Alien in cornfield. I mean, I just saw some aliens. Just dead. What the fuck is that noise? Do I go this way? Ah! Excuse me. We just close the door. Oh, 
What is that over there? Oh, I've got to go through the cornfields. I think I remember there being a fence through the cornfield. Oh, God, this is not a good idea. I am so going to get pro through here. Where do I even go? Oh, I'm going to get lost. Yeah, I'm lost. Oh! Ooh! Ooh! No, 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 no! Where's it going? Wait, is that my house? Uh, no! No, Henry! Oh. I mean... It's not the worst thing to happen, because Henry was kind of a rude little bitch. So, I hope you guys can teach him some manners. Oh, they're literally up there. Yeah, he's getting probed. Good. That's what we get for misbehaving. Oh, I'm in game. Can I play? Thank God. Amy called them. Wait. The cops are here? Oh, thank God. Oh, officer! Uh, hey! Oh. Um. Okay. Officer. You okay? Oh, there's no one in there. You dead. Oh. 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 That's a pretty bad crash. Oh, top secret. I uh, expected an invasion in Grey Hill on May 11th, 1992. So even the police knew about it. Why is there a secret Ooh. file on Grey Hill in a police car? Nice. It doesn't make any sense. Now we can start getting through some. Business. Three bullets. Nice. So, giving me a pistol is not a good sign because that means we're going to encounter some aliens. Do I go through this way? I does not. Ah. Hello. Bob. Thank God, Henry. They abducted him using some sort of ray or beam right through the roof. And a squad car crashed back there. I think Amy called him. But the car's empty and the officer's gone. Ryan, this is an absolute invasion. Do you know what that means? They'll abduct everyone in the village. Yes, nice. got a blind eye. Humans, animals, and it's every cool. little insect. They'll take samples of everything, making experiments of everyone. This is an extraterrestrial investigation. Oh, hi. <laughs> I don't want to as an alien experiment victim. <laughs> they already cleaned your house, so I don't think they're going to come back. I've already started to board up your place. This will save us. They ransacked my house. But Ryan, we have a problem. Oh, I used they up did. All the nails. They even locked me out my this own house. Morning, I brought all my nails to the Creek family. Mr. Creek put them on the table in their house. You have to go get them. It's the first house on the left. I think he boarded it up, but you have to find a way in. All right, I'll get them. We communicate by walkies from now on. Okie dokie. So, down here, yes. And then, first house on the left. Quick, test, test, test. Uh, can you hear me? Hello, hello. Over. Yeah, I can hear you. By the way, I found a gun in that crash that squad Max? car back there. <laughs> Let's hope I don't have to use it. Great. Be quiet and sneak around. It's dangerous if they hear the shots and see oh, you. Also, fuck. avoid using the flashlight. The Greys could see it immediately. And take note, it's important that they don't follow you into a house. If they do, we're screwed. If it becomes dangerous, hide in a car, a trash can, or something else. Damn it. Yeah, 
Great. Trash cans. Brandon would love to see that. Just get the shit out of me. <laughs> okay. Good luck, Ryan. I'm waiting for you. I swear I saw an alien down the road. That scared me so bad. Am I at the wrong house? No, I'm not gonna put through here. Wow! Grey man. The little grey men. They are here. Do I have to? You kind of gotta go inside, and he's also gone inside. Oh, it's not gonna be good, is it? I'm scared. Where did he go? What is that noise? Oh, he's right, he's right there. He's right there. Is he gonna come out? I'm gonna leave him in there. Why is these fucking nails? Slam the door! Fucking hell! Alright, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I have no idea what that thing was he was using. Is that a scanner or something? Alright, I just gotta turn back to. Oh, he's right there. Okay. Oh. That actually went quite well. Oh, I can't step over that for some reason. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Ryan doesn't know how to step over things. Oh, come on, Ryan. I got the nails. Great, Ryan, you've got them. I've Everything got some went ammo. well. Take Nothing it. happened. Ryan, Nothing were you happened. there? Oh. Brandon, I'm here. Aliens everywhere, Ryan. They tried to get inside my house. Rachel, go to your room. Hide under your bed. My house is boarded up, but I'm not sure if this helps. I need help, Ryan. Oh, no, the window. No, so I help you. You've sort of been a dick to me. Oh. Brandon! Brandon, hang on! I'm coming! Brandon is probed. Goodbye, Brandon. What's he doing? Okay. So Brandon's dead. You know that much. Goodbye, Brandon. Can we go this way? Nope. 
So, I have no idea where Brandon's house is. Oh, wait, there's a light. To be... Okay, no, don't go over there. No, no, do I? Okay, done. Um, yeah, I have no idea where Brandon's house is. So, me getting there save him is probably not going to happen. So yeah. He's probably dead. And Rachel. Rachel and Brandon have all been probed. They've all been tested on. You know, the grey men have fiddled with them, you know. They've all been fiddled with. Do I go back down here? Oh, yep. Can anyone hear me? Hello. Hello. Uh, Hello. Please, is, I can is hear someone you. there? My name's Ryan. Who is this? My name's Apone. Thank God you're here. Uh, I'm injured. I'm trapped in a barn. Jesus, what's that smell? Who are you? In which barn? There's tons of them. Sure, I just, I just woke up here. I, I can't remember what happened before that. You said your name is Ryan, right? I have to tell you something. The government, they, they know everything. They, they knew the invasion was happening here. They're gonna cover it up, like they always have. I'm sorry. I, I got here too late. Shit! Listen, Ryan, you have to get as much tinfoil as you can. At least five rolls. Hello? Hello? Uh, I think that was that cop that crashed his car. How does he know all of this? Where the hell am I going to find all that foil? So I need to get five rolls of file. Okay. Oh, 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 I think he's coming this way. Okay, maybe we'll go through the back way. Oh, no, 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 not that way, not that way, not that way. We are going to be absolutely glad. Oh, fuck! <laughs> okay, then. That happened. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Um, 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 um. Wait, 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 hang on, wait, I've got a baby bat, what am I doing? What? Oh, ho, 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 ho. what a knock in the fucking head that was. What? Oh, bitch. What? Is he dead? Nope, he's not dead. Finish him! Finish him! Death to the little green men. <laughs> this is brilliant. Okay, so I have murdered one grey man. Ooh. Ammo saver. Okay. So that's one dead. Ooh, fuck. Oh no, oh no, oh god, oh god. So I can have to murder another one then. Come here, buddy boo. What? Goodbye. Rest in peace, little grey turd. Oh, no. What? How many are there of you? I'll murder you all if I have to. What? Come on, bitch. What? Pa! Pa! Yeah. Dead. Okay, that should be all of them. 
Here we go. This should be the last one. That should be lovely. I should check in on Amy. She has to be in the diner. Amy! Where's Amy? She should be here. Well, she's not here. Oh, but I know what is here, though. It's a bit of midnight. Ooh. We pour ourselves a pint. Oh. De. 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 Whatever that says. Co. Co. Colub. Cab. Keep ma. Keep ma. They don't sound very interesting, but I'm willing to give it a try. Ooh, bollock. Thank you. So, Amy's not here then. So where the hell would Amy be? Ooh, a note. We're in the barn in front of the diner. Ah, okay. Oh, I see. I see. I see you. I see you. Hello. Hello. How everyone's Ryan, wearing these tin foil hats? That's great. Are you okay? No, nothing is okay. They abducted Henry. I have to find a way inside that UFO. Meanwhile, I've been trying to get to Brandon's house because he's in trouble, too. We'll help you, Ryan. The cars don't drive anymore, but maybe this old biplane does. We could use the biplane to get near the UFO. That seems like a long shot. But I guess it's our only option. But even if we do get close, how the hell are we going to get inside of that thing? I don't know. Maybe Matt has a solution for that. He is on the farm to get some stuff. Can you tell him that the biplane is almost repaired? Okay. All right. And by the way, that officer you called? They got him. They imprisoned him in a barn somewhere around town. I also found some odd documents about Greyhill in a squad car. I never call the police. Brandon forbid that. Oh. Yeah? But I thought you don't listen to our chief. Usually I don't listen to him. This time I did. But who called him then? No idea. I don't know. I'll go talk to Matt now. Can I go this way? Ryan, we'll find a solution to rescue Henry. I mean, there's no rush. You know, Henry's sort of like a rude little child. There's no rush. Matt, is that you? Don't like it how things are just closed behind me. Dealing with aliens and paranormal shit. I need to find a key. Oh, um, I have no idea where to find a key. Am I laying down? There's like a hiding spot or something. Oh! Oh, hello! Oh. Never mind. Thought it would be hard on that to find a key. Never mind. Key in the truck. Wait, this is the right key, yeah? Yes, it is. Oh. Sick. Oh, fuck. Hello? Hello? Help, I'm, I'm locked in here. Be any louder. Matt, what are you doing in there? I swear they hear them walking. Matt? You dead? Hello? Why did Matt stop speaking? Aliens oh, there came and I... I hid in the safe and, and now I'm... I'm locked in here. Oh, shit! Okay, um... I don't know the code, but I'll look for it. So just hang on. Wait, 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 Ryan, you don't think that they, um, you know, 
probe us when we become abducted. No. What? I don't know, man. They abducted Henry. I'm trying not to think about that right now. Just hang on and let me get you out of there. Oh, Ryan. We'll help you. Please. Please look for the code. So... My back hurts already. You... But make sure the greys don't fall. You locked yourself into a safe. That is very amusing. Otherwise, you have to lure them away. It almost makes me not want to let you out because you're just... Dumb. Just lock yourself in a safe and not have the code on you. Oh, poor little Matt. I almost don't want to rescue him. Oh, God. Oh! 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 No! Oh! No! Oh! No! Oh! No! Oh! No! Oh! No! Oh! Dear! Oh! Dear! Um! Oh! Dear! Run this way! Run this way! Loopy loopy! Loopy loop! Loopy loop! Out maneuver! Yeah! Get out maneuvered, son! See, these grey little aliens are not that smart. Oh, what does that say? 1969 Grey Hill. Oh! Get out! Get out! Get out of here! Like a bitch! Um, I don't know why I picked up the. Maybe that was the code? 19. Okay, run away. Run away. Now it's time to run away. Run away, run away. Is, is, that, is that the code? 1960. What was it? I can't even remember what it was. Ho hopefully it is, anyway. Let's just try. Oh, it is! Hey, oh my god. Hi, Maddie. Okay. Alright. Why would you I'm gonna go talk yourself to about our plan to rescue you? Locked himself in a safe. What a so what? you go and search for a barrel of kerosene and bring it to the barn gate. Yeah, I'll go find one. You just better have that plane ready. Kerosene can? When am I gonna find one of those? Um, oh, well, maybe here, because this is like a gas thing, isn't it? Yeah, apparently not. Um, oh, there's a church. Oh, wait, I see light. That might indicate that there's... Ah, hello. Here you are. Yeah, these lamps are quite helpful to be fair. Can I pick it? There we go. Okay, let's bring it to the barn door. Okay. Yeah, these are these little grey men are not so tough. They're easy to kill. The problem is, I I've only got one ball up, and I don't have enough to. Uh, that's not enough to kill one of them. So, uh, yeah. This light's kind of shit. Do I go through back this way? No? Ryan! Oh. Ryan, can you hear me? Hello? Huh? A pwn! I can hear you! What happened? I'm not sure. I... I can't think straight. They caught me. Bad. I think I got away before they could finish. Oh, did you get probed? Put something in me. Oh. It's cold to the touch. Some kind of metal, maybe. I'm almost at the church. Can you see it? I, I mean, I can Inside. see it and hear it. We need to talk about next steps. All right, I'll be right there. Oh, he got probed up the bum. Oh, hello. And I looked, and behold, oh, a stormy wind came out of the north. 
a great cloud with a fire enfolding itself, and a brightness round about it, and out of the mist thereof as if it were glowing metal, uh, out sir. of the mist of the fire, and out of the mist thereof came the likeness of four living creatures. And this was their appearance. They had the likeness of a man, Father and Christ. every one so of the, uh, the green man. Don't you hear that I'm preaching? Stop interrupting me! Did you see a police officer come through here? His name is Apone. And you think he can secure you from the angels of God? Bah. Father! Those aren't angels! This is an alien invasion! They abducted my son and I need to save him! Who knows what they're doing to him?! Ryan, he is in God's hands. What do you think when I give that the angels take me? Your son is blessed. Oh no. It begins. It begins now. Oh, oh good God. Father. I mean... Oh, gunshots. I mean, if he thinks that's God's word, he is going to be in for a rough time. They are going to fiddle with his bumper. It's not going to be pretty at all. I can tell you that much. Oh! I'm going to agree that. I'm here! Hello! Ryan, glad to finally meet you. No, you don't look so good. Listen, these motherfuckers, they, they probed me. Oh. It hurts. I can't help you anymore. But here's the number of the man who sent me here. Oh. Take it. Thank you. <laughs> they took my son. Do you know how to get him back? Call the number. He'll know what to do. He'll help you find your son. Help you stop this invasion. <laughs> He's done this before. Before? Don't call anybody else. Not the police. Not the government. They won't help you. <clears throat> not unless you want to end up in the psych ward if you survive all this. Only trust the man on this number. <clears throat> I never thought I'd die in a goddamn graveyard. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh. A pwn! A pwn! Hello. Don't die, goddammit! Where the fuck am I gonna find a working phone? What a way to go. Get probed in the bum and then die. Yeah, you know, that's, uh, that's, that's how I wanna go, you know? Get probed and die. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm saying. Do I go this way? <laughs> So a working phone. Hmm. It's going to be quite difficult. I have no idea where I'm going to find a working phone to. Oh. A phone. Out of order. Uh, of course the phones it is. Obviously. Guess I'll have to check the telecom pedestal down the street. Oh, I gotta go down the road. Forty-eight footsteps. Oof! Fuck. I actually have don't have enough ammo to kill one, so I literally cannot get caught. But you can't even see him. He blends in so well, and that's not me being racist. You can't be racist to aliens. See, no one these days you probably can. Probably loads of people probably identify it as a. Oh, 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 oh my god! Hide in here. Hide in here. Wait, did you not know I came in the house? Bullets. I need bullets. 
This is America. Where, where, where's all your guns and ammos? So unrealistic. Okay. Well, I have no idea where I'm going to find a working part for the phone. Oh shit. Please give me a bullet or something. Please, I need one. Oh, why is there no ammo? Oh, I should really turn my flashlight, shouldn't I? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Whack! Right, I'm gonna like, I think, well, I'm just gonna try and knock him out. I need to just make a run for it. Run around the Rosie, run around the Rosie, run around the Rosie. Whack! Shut door, and fuck off. There's nothing in there for me. Fucking stairs. <gasps> what? I can kill one. I can kill one of these fuckers. Hmm. I'm not finding anything to help me with the phone. Did I check over here? Oh! Alien probe! Oh god! That's fucking huge! Holy shit! Oh! That would be very uncomfortable if I went up your ass. Found anything that will help me? Shh. Oh shit! He sees me. Well, it looks like you would be the one to die, my friend. What? I need to pull on the gun. Dead. Oh. Hey, this Ooh. actually might work. Ooh, I found it. Do I need to go over here? Oh, there's one of them that's you over there. Um, I have no bullets. Um. Um. Uh. And I'll try and sneak around them. Shit, he's coming this way. Oh wait, that's perfect. That she's going over there. Yeah, go over there. Go over there. Perfect. There. Go. That should about do it. Now time to call this mystery man. Wait, what's in this car? Absolutely nothing. Okay. Let's go and call this number. One left. Oh, 
Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh good god, no. Oh, Ryan! Oh, I got abducted. Did I have to redo all that again? Oh, no. Oh, I do. Oh, no way. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, two seconds, guys. Alright, okay, right. We finally got them all again. That was fucking annoying. No matter, no matter. <gasps> Bullets. Oh, he's not gonna answer, is he? God. Damn it. Please pick up the phone. Oh, I got legs. I did not yeah. know that. Uh, hey. My name's Ryan. I'm calling from Greyhill. Your friend Depone gave me this number. He... He's dead. I'm... I'm sorry. He told me that he came too late and that I should call this number. Depone is dead. Ryan. Did he tell you about using tinfoil? And if so, do you have enough? Yeah, I got it. Listen, they took my son. He's on board one of those fucking ships. A pwn said you can help me. Yeah, I can. Now listen to me and do what I tell you. Wrap your entire body in the tinfoil. Completely cover yourself head to toe. And let them abduct you. That's I know a this sounds crazy, plan, isn't it? But if you want your son back, you have to trust me. I don't want to get uh, probed. Seriously? Yes. Ryan, trust me. Who exactly are you? And how do you know this works? Oh. Fuck. This is the most stupid thing I've ever done. How does I don't know get how tinfoil like helps you as well. Alright, that's it. God, I look like an idiot. Oh good god. I look fine. So it's like why I don't know how tinfoil will actually help. What am I lot? Oh here a car. Hello? Oh, and I- oh, Amy got the plane going. Oh, there she is! We got the plane working! But the guy on the phone said his plan won't work. I have to warn them. Amy, can you hear me? Matt! Matt, can you hear me? Ah, oh, fuck. I'll try it again later. But where's the plane? I don't hear them anymore. Where do I? It's a bit worrying, isn't it? Do I go? Which way do I go? Ah, yeah, I see the gate. Oh god, there's two of them now. Oh, what? Jesus Christ. It's a goddamn UFO parking lot out here. You're gonna have to go around them. Yo, know, if you're gonna park there, you better not so you don't get a parking fine. Because I'm pretty for UFO, it's probably like maybe a couple of thousand dollars. Should have parked somewhere else, guys. Nani. They probably already got parking tickets anyway. The only people I would not mind if they abduct is parking people. Parking ticket people. They suck. Ryan! Ryan! Hello? Ryan! Can you hear me? Yeah, hey, I'm good. Okay? But something is wrong with Amy and Matt. <laughs> They started the biplane to rescue Henry, but I don't know where they are, and I can't hear the plane anymore. They might have been Dead. taken by those things. Hey, where are you? What's your plan? I'm pretty close to Brandon's house. This detour took way longer than expected. 
I hope he's okay. Ooh. I don't have time to explain everything, but this cop I met. They Ooh, got him. He's dead. <laughs> Looks more like a buck. Oh my god. No. He was Ryan. sent to warn us by a mysterious man. Now that was Brandon's kid. And he She's told me still the in the only house. way to rescue Henry is to dress up in tinfoil and let them abduct me. I know, I know. It sounds crazy, but if it's the only shot I have to get Henry back, I have to try. Yes! That could work! Well, at least to avoid them going into your brain. I'll guide you once you're in it. <laughs> Sounds good. Oh. Make sure you get your van up and running. Once I get Henry, we'll drive out and meet with the mysterious man. He can help us figure this all out. Um. Wait, Bob. That that sounds like Amy's walkie. That's Amy. Amy. Amy, Amy are you there? Amy. I can't hear you. Can you hear me? Henry! Coming from? I'm coming for you! God damn it! Fuck! No! Please, no! God! You great bastard! Get your fucking fingers out of my dirty ass! Oh. Is that Brandon? What the fuck are they doing to him? They think they're all on the same ship. What in the hell should I do now? That's a cool little house. Ooh, we got bullets for me. Thank you, Brandon. Thank you very much. Oh fuck! Rachel! <laughs> Ryan! <laughs> um, what are you Hello! Doing? Oh man. I'm so glad they didn't get you. I was hiding under my bed, oh. but they got daddy! They got daddy! Uh, yeah, shit. Look at you. You little shit. My dad says the government is lying about everything. Well, teddy he's bear. right. But don't worry, though. I'll protect you. I have to get on that saucer to save him, so I'll bring you to Bob, okay? He can watch after you until I come you back with your dad. You can't protect me? My dad says you're a weakling, and you can't protect anybody. He said you couldn't even save your own marriage. Uh, well, well, why are we I saving Brandon if you're saying stuff don't about believe me like everything that? he says? Fuck him, leave him. Besides, leave the aliens fist his ass. Over here. <laughs> and your dad's the one stuck on the ship. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I just said that. What? Where is your son? Where is Henry? <sighs> oh they my god, you look like a demon him. child. Ryan, that sounds like a car. Oh, it does. What? They must be driving through town, stopping for gas or something. Can I see them? Gas is well. Hey, you got barbed I wire in your fucking in house. Vietnam like my dad was, right? Uh, demon child. No. Well, can you check the window? Okay. God bless you. Huh? Rachel, oh. no. Where are you going? Stay. Ah! What the fuck? What, what the fuck is going on with this kid? Why is he what running the hell away? Is Brandon teaching his daughter. Rachel. Yoo-hoo. Fuck for a small girl, she runs fucking fast. <laughs> fucking hell. She fucking sprinted down the street. You know what? Oh, she gets abducted. Fuck her. <laughs> Oh, here's the car. With no one in it. The dead. No. They got him. Oh. Rachel! See, Rachel, this is why you don't run into the cornfields. You stay out of the cornfields. Because the cornfields is where the aliens. The a this is literally aliens' fucking turn on area. This. They get the dicks out from the fucking cornfields like this. Honestly. Does anyone know better? Like, oh, Max? Huh? Max? Is that you? Fuck, Rachel. Oh. Oh. 
she got abducted. That is it! Let them take me! Do I... Uh, Rachel! She's still here! Where are you then? I don't see her anywhere. Oh, fuck! Hello! No, you're not taking me. Screw you. I refuse. Wait, should I let him take? No. Oh, Alex. Oh! Back, demon! Bitch. I mean, should I let him take me? I feel that would have just failed the game anyway. Oh, great. I'm super lost. Ah, oh, gate. On the way out. Rachel! Ooh. What the hell? It looks like the light from the shed. Ryan! Ryan, are you here? Ryan! Uh, yeah. Bob. A few of them greeted me some minutes ago while I was out working on the caravan. After taking a photo shoot, I asked them if they wanted to have some coke, but. Bob, it's okay. All good. I got it. Just joking! I imprisoned one in the bedroom and I put a tinfoil hat on him. No. I'm gonna make some experiments, but I won't. Probe him. Bob, I swear. Please stop. Uh, maybe sell him on the black market. Got Brandon's daughter, so I'm a little busy. Uh, what okay. Do you need? I found a solution to make the caravan work. It'll take me a few minutes to get oh, it done. Bob, that's great. That's what I needed to hear. It'll be our chance to get out of this town. I have to save Rachel first. She's trapped in the barn by the gas station. I'm going to get her. Then we can make a plan to save Henry. Yes, Ryan. We have to be fast with Henry. Ooh. Bob, can you not say shit like that? I don't even want to think about it. I heard Brandon causing trouble for them on the saucer through Amy's walkie. I think they're all on the same Ooh, shit. She drinking beer. Look it up. Bye, Ryan. Jesus Christ. I actually like Bob. He's quite, he's quite funny. Right, I got four bullets left. So that means I can kill two of these bastards. Not a problem. Oh. So I don't need to like find a way in. Um. Rachel is in there. Why the hell did they use a bike chain to lock the gate? It's crazy. So I'm gonna have to find some bolt cutters or something to get through there. Why can't anything ever go smoothly? How about those? Death! Bam. Come on, bitch. What? What? Goodbye. Perfect. It's actually quite satisfying killing them. Don't know why. Where? Hello. I'm not just like. Okay, now I'm out of ammo. Hopefully there's no more. Alright, I got the ball cars. Let me cut this open. Perfect. Ah, oh, hello Rachel. Oh, Rachel, I'm here. Oh, it's a caravan. Whoa! Come with me if you want to. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, he is fucking Glad you're mental. here. And the caravan's working. I'm gonna put Rachel in your bedroom. Wait, what's your cat? She needs rest. What'd you do with your cat? Oh. Bob, seriously. You imprisoned an alien. I, I told you I did it, dude. Just lay her on the carpet. But again. I didn't probe him. Didn't probe him. 
Just put a tinfoil hat on it. Ha ha. So funny. Bob. I think he's one of their dentists, not one of their butt drawers. Butt drawers? That doesn't sound good, Bob. Oh, Bob. I'll go out and try and get its attention. I need to get it to abduct me. It's my only shot at getting Henry back. Drive to Nevada and take Rachel with you. I think that's where our mysterious friend is. I'm gonna work with your mysterious friend together, Bob, to bring all this to the public. All right. His number is 555-0199. Call him as soon as possible. And Bob, all right, I gotta go. Thank you. Stay safe. Bye, Bob. Uh, Ryan, you know, you were the only one who didn't think I was crazy. Thanks for that, man. I love you. Love you too, Bob. See you, Bob. Okay, I'm ready. Hey, uh, take me to the mighty heavens of ass whooping and painful moving. Oh, fuck, that's bright. Bye, Bob. Black screen. Is it working? Henry? Henry? Oh, please show us inside the ship. I thought I was on the scene inside the main ship. No. You're lying. All right. See ya. Oh, there's a cat. Kitty! That's not, wait, no, that's Max! Oh! Macky Boos! I wonder if he's still got the alien with him. Yep! Things seem to have worked out pretty good for Rachel and me. I hate that we don't know what happened on the UFO to Ryan and the others, but. Well, after Ryan was abducted, his dog Max came along and. Together, we're now on our way to meet this mysterious man. I mean, that was the Grey Hill incident. Time for a new book, yeah? God, I hope I'll find the publisher this time. Ah, look at me. Rambling again. Well, I hope you folks enjoyed yourself. Catch you on later down the road. Is that, is that really the end? Hey, Rachel. What was your favorite part about the story of Grey Hill? Who are you just talking to? Oh. Right, I'm gonna cut that because I can't write music. But, oh my, that's the ending. We don't get to see what happens to Ryan. That was such a good game. I really enjoyed that. Oh my god, that was so good. Didn't take us long to complete as well. It took us like an hour or something so. So that's actually right. Because like there was a beta for this and I missed it. So I'm happy I got to play the full version. Oh, that was great. Well, yeah, that is the Great Hill instance. If you guys enjoyed me, you should like and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. See you.